Hey guys, this is Iman Hamam, and we're here with Harper's Bazaar UK, and I'm going to show you all of my beauty products, everything I use for my morning routine. So let's start. I always love to start my morning routine with lighting up a candle. So we're going to do that right now. This is the Lilabo Santel number 26. I love to set a mood. I'm all about, you know, smells and just feeling good. So the morning is always such a important moment for yourself because that's like the start of the day i've already kind of cleansed my face so i like to use this rose water um by the heritage store um to kind of wake up the skin We as Moroccans use so many natural products and one of them is rose, rose petals as in an oil or as a spray. So rose water is always in my routine. That second step, we're gonna go for one of my favorite Estee Lauder products, which is the a &R Night Repair Serum. I die for this product. I travel with it, it's always in my bag. I think for myself, I love when the skin is just like hydrated and glowy and this is the perfect product. So even like after a long flight, I get so dry. And so I always have this product and I just like massage my skin. I like to put my hair up because as you can see, I have a lot of hair and it always likes to go everywhere. This is my favorite kind of moment because I give myself a little massage because why not? We're gonna go in with this beautiful rose oil. Do a little drops on my hand. Again, kind of warm up the product. I get really tense right here. So I like to give myself a little massage and relax my jaw go in the neck as well. Then I love this tool. This is the Esimosis Epic Tool. This really kind of helps penetrate the product and like really lets the product go into your pores. Okay, last step of skincare, very important in my daily routine, SPF. This is a beautiful propolis sunscreen by Epicurne. I'm kind of a girl that if a product works, I'll just like keep using it forever. This is a product that I've been using for like over five years and it's perfect. I'm going to use this double wear foundation and it has SPF. So it's kind of like a two in one. This product really feels like a second skin. It's sheer, so it's not like too much coverage. I'm gonna use this little sponge. Kind of apply it all over the skin. I think my signature beauty look, it's kind of simple. I don't like to go too crazy, especially in the morning and it's sweaty and hot. So I like to just keep it simple, um, but you know, still look cute and kind of elevate my eyes or, or my brows. I feel like my skin still looks very natural, just has a little bit of foundation, but I still like to do a little bit of coverage um, with these concealers. So this is a little darker, a little warmer. Um, I do have a tan right now, so I like to kind of go with the lighter. This is number you know, 4W medium. I kind of like to go a little bit under the eye. A little bit here, everywhere where I feel like it needs to be a little lighter. I go in with the darker. And I kind of just do a little here. And 
Yeah, I think being on set most of the time and working with like all these incredible, talented makeup artists, I feel like I'm always like asking questions like, what do you use or what, what should I use? And, and so I've always gotten like a lot of tips. I think one of them that I do every day, I think is kind of what I just did is like always kind of like a triangle. So this part always kind of needs to be lighter and then you warm up the outside of the face. I didn't know that, I found out and I was like, oh, okay. That's in, that makes sense. So we kind of blended everything in. Still looks really natural. Normally I don't really, I do use mascara, but today I feel like I want to just keep it natural. So I'm going to just curl my lashes. What I like to do is just use a little bit of argan oil. I love argan oil. Um, and just kind of brush my lashes with the argan oil to give them a little hydration. I'm gonna brush my brows. I like to just kind of brush my brows and not really do anything to them. Unless I'm like going out, I'll like fill them in, but it's an easy day today. So we're just gonna brush them. Oops. And I just line on my lip. Okay. And then I like to use my finger and kind of make it not so dark. I like to like look at videos and try to like figure out what looks good on my skin and my eyes and my lips but I feel like what I've learned I kind of just do and it always works so I'm very confident in doing my own makeup then I'm gonna go in with this pure color revitalizing crystal balm I love this product and it's always in my bag it's very sheer so it's like a gloss kind of that I go on top of when I'm running around and I don't have blush I love to just also kind of put it here I give myself a little color I think it just is a product that you can use for everything We finished the skincare and makeup. Now it's time for hair. I did wash my hair yesterday and I kind of curled it. So I'm gonna use this beautiful product from Christophe Robin. It's the leave-in mist. So I just like to spray it in to kind of refresh my curls. I started learning doing my hair when I was like, probably like 16. I think for the longest time, I didn't know what to do with my hair. So my mom was like kind of, you know, my teacher. Uh, but then when I was 16, I finally started exploring. Honestly, natural oils have always worked for my hair. Um, argan oil is something I learned from my mom that I use every day. Um, I love argan oil because it really, protects your hair from damage. My heart, my hair needs a lot of product. <laughs> it's like so dry. So anything I put in, it just like sucks it in. So guys, that was kind of the end. I'm done and I'm ready to start my morning. So thank you for watching and I really hope you guys had fun. I did and I hope to see you guys soon. Bye.